Did you know corporate greed once killed 88 men in two separate bridge disasters? In 1907, engineers planned the world's longest cantilever bridge across the St. Lawrence River in Quebec. The chief engineer Theodore Cooper never once visited the construction site, approving everything by mail from New York. To cut costs, they used lighter steel despite safety warnings from inspectors. Workers reported hearing dangerous creaking sounds for days, but construction continued. On August 29, 1907, the bridge began groaning loudly as workers tried to evacuate. In just 15 seconds, the entire south span collapsed, crushing 75 men under twisted steel. The investigation revealed criminal negligence, but incredibly, disaster struck again. In 1916, while installing the replacement span, it fell directly into the icy river below. Thirteen more workers screamed as they plunged to their deaths with the collapsing steel. The bridge finally opened in 1917, standing as a monument to 88 men killed by engineering incompetence. Corporate corner cutting had turned an ambitious project into a double tragedy, 